So we're back now. It's risen the, for the second time. So I'm just going to take it out of the bowl. And my son and I are going to show you how to make a loaf. So, uh, give him a little chunk. Yes, a little piece for you. All right, so now this bread is ready to make into a loaf. So we're going to flatten it. Can you flatten it, Corbin? Just flatten it into a little bit of a square. Remember? Good job. All right, so you have a little bit of a square, and then we're going to roll it. And the reason I do it that way is so that there's no air bubbles in it. So then we roll it, and as I roll it, I bring in the ends, like this. And the reason I do that is just so that it uh, is more uniform like a loaf instead of being like a roll. So bring in the ends, and roll it. And then you pinch it all the way to the bottom and the side just so that it holds the seam together. And then turn it around. You go like this a little bit just so it seals the seam. So now you've got a nice loaf. Okay. Are you pinching it all? Okay. While he finishes that, then we make sure to grease your pans because bread sticks very well to bread pans. So you grease all around. And then you take your nice loaf and you put it in the bread pan. You cover it up and you let it rise. It'll be about 25 minutes more to rise it. And then we can start to cook it. I forgot to get you one. All right. Can you show your nice loaf to the camera? Here's your nice loaf. We'll see you in a bit.